Dr. John Faustus summons up the devil and he eventually makes a pact with the devil where he gives his soul to Lucifer in order to have Mephistopheles as his servant for the next 24 years. There were quite a few things that appealed to me about this. One was him, um, another was working here, um, and I'd known the play for, for quite a long time then, since I was, since I was younger, I saw a production when I was about 14, and it scared the life out of me. Um, and it's always been something that I've wanted to do, so when it came up, I, I just got really excited about it. We're using puppets on a very big scale. Mephistopheles initially appears as a, as a kind of monster, as a, then later takes human form. And some of these, we're talking six, ten metre wingspan for some of these puppets, you know, they're really big. One of the flying dragons has a wingspan of about five metres. Lucifer's wings on his back go to about eight metres. You have a big Chinese dragon that's about 18 metres long. So they're all pretty big. What's been great about this production is the challenges of designing the big puppets and the fact that we're in this world of devils and Lucifer and angels. And one of the challenges is trying to find a language to create those on stage. The big advantage of using magic in theatre becomes getting closer to what we, we're used to, where we're used to seeing stories told now, which is through TV and more importantly movies. There is no CGI on the stage of the play. Everything has to be done live. We do as many of these effects that are written in as best we can, as live as possible. And that's where magic in theatre becomes special effects. It's that amazing thing of just having a massive crowd of people who can marvel. It's kind of what you just said, marvel at kind of all these things around. But then when someone is speaking, it's just amazing to have this hushed, you know, group of people just hanging on the world. I think, I think this, play, this play really lends itself. It's really simple why we should come and see Dr. Faustus this summer at the Globe Theatre is it will be the best production of Dr. Faustus anyone has ever seen. The combination of the adaptation and the design and the direction and the puppetry is incredible and of course you have to do some really cool magic as well. It won't have ever been done this good. They can expect to see massive puppets on a, on a scale, on a large scale. They can see magic and illusion and fire. They can see a really good version of Faustus done brilliantly.